What is going on guys, Chris here and welcome back to another video. In today's episode, we're going to be trying to solve the Nautilus. Um, what is the Nautilus? It's this guy. Well, it's meant to be this guy. So what is up? I got this puzzle from Cubes UK a couple of days ago. I did film an unboxing of it and I played around with it a little bit and managed to scramble it up. Um, but it wasn't a very good video so I decided to scrap it. Um, I'm kind of tired of unboxing videos anyway so that's that. But here we have the Nautilus. This is essentially like a square one semi modification. It's not really a modification of a square one. Um, it's a little bit different from that, um, but you have this slice in the middle uh, and this this kind of middle layer here is that slice and then you can move the top and the bottom layers around, but of course you have to have a complete slice, uh, so I guess like, uh, like this, and that's how it works. Uh, and you've got to get it back into this shape. So you've got to line it up so it's red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, pink. Uh, and it forms this kind of nautilus shape. Um, and it has some instructions in here. I did take a quick glance at them and I have no clue what on earth it is. It's like this big flow chart of stuff. And uh, yeah, so it wasn't helpful anyway. So there you go. But here it is, uh, the nice scrambled nautilus. So one thing that I have noticed with playing with this is that this middle layer is, as I said, on a slice. So it will only ever go back and forth like this. Um, and obviously one of those two states is the solved kind of like smooth Nautilus. That doesn't change so far as I can tell. The slice is only ever um, down this one um, slice. So that's good. That's good to know. Um, and as I mentioned before, we have to have a 180 um, kind of degree portion. So you can only ever do half of the puzzle at a time. Uh, so for example, like this, uh, sometimes it'll be ever so slightly off and it simply does not work. Um, and you can maybe force it, but like here, obviously you can't do the slice because this guy's here. So yeah, I have a fairly good understanding of this puzzle but uh, I guess we're gonna try and solve it now. So, I guess, oh, well we have this immediately, which is quite nice. So we can somehow keep a hold of this, and we need to get a red up here. Um, hang on, can we do that? Not quite. Uh, yeah, as I, as I mentioned, it has to be exactly 180 degrees. This is ever so slightly off. I found that sometimes it is off by like a couple of degrees and it totally throws off the puzzle. Um, but yeah, so this pink piece is causing an issue for us. We should maybe see if we can resolve that. Let's put the pink here. And then is that, that's not quite 180, so we can't do anything with that. Um, so maybe, where is the slice now? There. Oh, maybe we should move the oranges. So let's move the orange round. And then is there a red we can use? Is there any way we can use the red? I don't think so. I mean, a large part of this is just finding a slice I can use. Oh, there, there's a slice we can use. Like that. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, it's not solved. I thought it was solved. Um, well, it is almost solved. I'm assuming this is just like a square one parity. Maybe not. Okay, so for those of you who haven't seen, I accidentally have solved the top and bottom, but this middle slice is flipped the wrong way around. So, attempting to solve that then, what do I do with this? Oh, 
Oh, this so sorry. The slice is only ever in one spot, and I was just doing it wrong. Is that it? Almost. Hold on. So it looks like we have a parity in the respect that we need like a three a three cycle that will keep the top and bottom solved but we'll fix this middle bit because obviously we can go or is it a two cycle yeah it needs to be three so if we somehow cycle this round there we go that was easy um, alright, that's it then, I guess. That was painfully disappointing. Um, I, I don't know why I was expecting that to be harder, but it wasn't, because so much of the puzzle was bandaged, because you can only do 180 degree moves. It was very easy to solve, because these three pieces here were almost never apart from one another, especially these two. So when we had this kind of triple piece paired up here as soon as we got the red over these three fell into place and that basically solved the other side as well um i wonder if you can have one side solved and the other one not but i don't think so because that would be a huge coincidence if it was and then obviously the parity in the middle here was quite easy so <sighs> yeah i wonder what happened there all right, well, since this video is kind of short, I guess I'll just talk about something else for a minute. Um, just so you guys know, this video was not sponsored by Cubes UK. Uh, I purchased this puzzle and another one with my own money. Uh, you'll see the other one fairly shortly. It is this guy. So as I said, uh, this isn't sponsored content, and I know I'm an affiliate of the store, so I obviously support it, but um, I purchased these at about 12 o'clock one day, um, and they arrived at about nine o'clock the next day. So it took less than 24 hours for these puzzles to arrive. I know it's based in the UK and I live in the UK, so I guess that's not overly amazing, but I am super proud of, of this store that I support. Um, I think it's absolutely fantastic. I love the work that they do uh, and it's just excellent, excellent customer service. And I really wanted to say that in this video just because, you know, it's, it's a puzzle that I bought myself. So I kind of went through the process of what every other person who buys from the store goes through and I've had a really good experience so um, you can check out Cubes UK in the description I've left my affiliate link there so if you want to buy anything please do that um, if not it doesn't matter I just said what I wanted to say and that's the end of this video so thanks a lot for watching if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up if you didn't I guess give me a thumbs down leave a comment below let me know what you think about this um, did I just get super lucky or is it a bit more tricky than that? And finally, subscribe and you'll be notified whenever I make a new video. Have a fantastic day and I'll see you guys next time.